Hi friends, welcome to today's video. Today's video is about understanding the concept of price to book ratio to evaluate companies. Welcome to my channel. My channel is centered towards sharing the information on financial concepts in short videos, so it may help you become a better investor. If you like the content, do subscribe the channel and like the video so it may help the other people to understand the financial concepts. So, what is a price to book ratio? In simple language, price to book value is the ratio of the market value of a company's shares over its book value of equity. The book value is defined as the difference between the book value of assets and the book value of liabilities. Price to book value ratio is often used by investors to understand whether a stock is valued high or low. A price to book ratio of 1 means that the stock price is trading in line with the book value of the company. In other words, the stock price would be considered fairly valued. A company with a high price to book ratio could mean the stock price is overvalued, while a company with a lower price to book could be undervalued. Now, let's understand how to calculate the price to book ratio. Price to book ratio is market price per share divided by book value per share. Let's understand this with an example. Let's say that a company named XYZ Limited has the following information. Assets equals to rupees 100 crores. Liabilities equals to rupees 75 crores. Outstanding shares equals to 10 crores and stock price equal to rupee 5 per share. We first calculate the company's book value and book value per share. So, the book value will be rupees 25 crores that is rupee 100 crores assets minus rupees 750 crore liabilities. The book value per share will be rupees 2.5 that is 25 crore book value divided by 10 crore shares. Now we can calculate the price to book value ratio. For this, we will divide stock price rupee 5 by book value per share rupee 2.5. This will give us the price to book value ratio of 2. In other words, the stock of XYZ Limited is trading at 2 times its book value. Now, whether the valuation is justified depends on how the price to book ratio compares to its value in years past and the ratio of other peer companies within the same industry. So, do consider these factors before taking a decision to invest your money based on price to book value of a stock. This brings us to the end of the video. Give a thumbs up if you like the video and do subscribe to get a notification for upcoming videos. Goodbye and have a nice day.